Hey everyone, thank you so much for tuning in with me for this collective message for your confessions. Because this is your confessions. Please take whatever resonate, leave whatever don't. Everything may not resonate with everyone because this is a general message. Um, I actually started the confessions. I actually finished the confessions and realized that I was on mute. And it was a really interesting, very interesting message. Um, but if some of the messages come out in this, then I will provide it. Other than that, I'm just going to leave that message there. Maybe they don't want me to provide it. But the thir but 33 could be significant because that came out in that reading as well. And I just seen 33. So, yeah, they definitely want me to push that out there. 44 as well. Maybe you have been seeing 33 or 44 or the synchronicities of threes or fours. Okay. All right. Let's get into it, y'all. Spirit, please show us a message. Hold on. Okay. Please show us a message for this confession. Because this is your confession. All right. Someone is doing black magic on you. I'm sorry I left. Karmic put something in my food. Oh. So that's what they're saying. Like, someone put something in, in their food. This is why they are, like, it's different or something. I don't know. They're realizing it. So someone, so they're realizing, like, hold on, somebody put, yeah, mm-hmm. That's why you cannot trust everybody, okay? You cannot, you cannot trust everybody. No, 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 especially not eating everybody food. I be telling folks, like, you cannot. You cannot. But they're going to learn today, whoever this is. But they're sorry that they left. Show us more on this energy. Show us more. Hmm. The karmic is trying to compete with you. Lord. <laughs> well, let the best men win. Because <laughs> what? If you're karmic, why are you competing with me? You know what I mean. Not me, but hey, with me. But with you, like, why are they competing? If you're karmic, whoever this is is karma. You you got to be, you're the divine. You're definitely in higher vibration than this person. So there's no competition. That's where I'm going with this. Like, there's no competition. Show us more. I miss my family. So maybe you have a family with this person or... um. Maybe you share children or you had a, you were a family once upon a time or, you know, they view you as family. You view them as family. However, you may have said, like, we're going to have a family. However, this is. Show us more. Someone, someone could have Aquarius in their chart. What else? Karmic is using the divine masculine. Mm. What else? I tapped and hacked your phone. <laughs> Okay, and like, okay, did you get what you need? <laughs> no one compares to you. I see that now. What else? Had sex in a car on a lunch break. That's when it all started. You make me happy. Well, I couldn't have made you too happy because you, whoever this is, dealing with the karmic, right? <laughs> Someone got a karmic mother. Mm. We got a hotel key. Something significant about a hotel key. You may have seen a hotel key. Or this person just going to hotels. They This person just having sex at work on lunch break at the hotel. They could have a hotel near them or near their job. Mm. We got gossip. What else? Virgo. What else? X still wants them. So an X still wants someone... So either your ex still wants you, this or well, clearly, um, but the ex, whoever this, maybe this car, the karmic is their ex. This could have been who they end up having sex with, dealing with again, and that's the one who's doing spell work, um, did spell work on now. It's just, yeah, they just wanted me to give a whole nother message because this is definitely not the same exact message, not even close, but it's it's it's, it's still crazy. Um, what else, spirit? Things are falling apart. Now that part, for sure. What else? 
stripper and prostitutes. Yeah, someone, I was going to say, like, someone got a sex addiction or something. Because, golly, if you make them happy, why the heck they stepping out? They having sex at work, on lunch, in the car, on lunch break. So, the sex is more important than you in re-energizing yourself, getting some food, getting some a drink. Like, what the heck? So, you just decide to go and have sex and not go and replenish your energy what so yeah and then not only that the hotel key strippers and prostitutes it's just too much going on here we got blackmail someone's trying to oh someone someone had some information on someone and they they was holding this over their head they're trying to blackmail them so that's why they could have uh left you or something that a lot of detectives says they are the pappy third party. It could have been, yes, they could have had a child, got pregnant with someone, and someone was trying to blackmail them. Oh, if you don't leave this person to be with me, I'm going, I got all the proof. Like, you loser, go find you something else to do. But yeah, we got no one understands me but you. I can be myself with you. Someone could be a Sagittarius as well. It's just so who is going through this? Who is going through this? What? I didn't even have to use this deck in the other message. And I thought that message was crazy. But this one? For me to have to put this one out? This deck? Show us a message here, Spirit. What else? On this confessions. The next hex that they do on you will be their last. So whoever doing the hexing, the curses, or whatever. Bye-bye. <laughs> That's what's going to happen because, again, we got the very first card that came out was someone is doing black magic on you or on this person. Final destination. Yes, yeah, time's up. <laughs> time's up. <laughs> Time is up on this magic. Mm hmm Because you are too much of a high vibrational being. You are. Yes, you are. We got don't want them with. T Wait, what? Don't want them to be with you. So this could be the crazy psychopath uh, karmic that they're dealing with. They don't want this person to be with you. Or this could be your ex. They psychopath, okay? Um, it's a lot of karmic here. We got a karmic mother. Then we got a karmic ex. You could be the karmic... I mean, you could be the... Your person... Wait. You could have been dealing with a karmic. That's just what this is. Ugh. And their mother is a karmic. There's just a lot going on here. Someone drinking like a fish. Yeah, someone got a shoebox full of items stolen from women and or men to do sex spells and love spells to bind them. Mm. Mm. Yeah, they out here. People do that. That's why, be careful. Just open your eyes. Pay attention. You feel like something is off, it's off, okay? Don't overthink it. We got co-worker. We got hiding money. So someone that they, they could have been dealing with someone sexually at work. This could have been a co-worker. They end up joining a connection, bond with, and not realizing this person was doing black magic on them to, woo! And then they was trying to get to hide money from you. What in the heck y'all going on? <laughs> so they could have gotten cahoops with this karmic, not knowing that they were doing spell work on them. This person, the karmic, oh, y'all, it's just too much. My head hurting. So you could have been dealing with a karmic, right? Let's just say that. Whoever your ex is was a karmic. They were a karmic. They're realizing that you were the best thing that they ever had. They end up dealing with a karmic as well. Yo, karmic found their partner. That's what it is. They got with the right person. So, not only... Oh, Lord. So, this person... Um... Yeah, so this person got with, with a karmic, they a karmic to you, and then that person was doing spell work on them, and, and, and the karmic that you were dealing with, they were doing spell work on you. It's just a whole bunch of mess here. Um, and they they realized that all along, the karmic, whoever they were dealing with, so it could be a co-worker or someone that they that was meeting up at work or something, or at a hotel, 
um, to have sex or whatever, but they realized that this person was competing with you. This person, they could have tapped your phone. Your your karmic, the karmic could have tapped your phone, and their karmic could have tapped their phone. Just, just a a, a bit much. And but th at first, this person was thinking like, okay, let's uh something about money. They got with this, whoever this co-worker, whoever this is, they was working with and having sex with. Like, they could have formed a some type of promise. Like, yeah, you know, I'll help you do this if that, blah, blah, blah. And, yeah, someone like, man, if you, if you walk away now, see, it's two karmics dealing with each other. If you walk away now, oh, I, I, I could prove that... This is your child. I do have like so 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 it's a third party to have a child with this person. That's the karmic that they were working with or that they were having sex with at work. One or the other. Either they work with this person and having sex or this person used to come to their work and they used to have sex. Something like that. But however it is, they're karmic, karmic and a karmic dealing with each other. Why is this coming out? I don't know. You tell me, let me know in the comments. You know, what part resonate with you? Because maybe not all of this is your message, but a part of this, like, you know, something is hitting home for someone. For a lot of you, all this is hitting home. It's like, yep, 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 yep. So just let me know in the comments below what is what. Someone is a Virgo here. So what I might do, you guys, um, I may just go ahead and do, uh, I may do Virgo, I may do a Virgo uh, weekly message. Just because they're standing out in this reading. And Aquarius did show up. But it it didn't really like come out. Come out. So I'm not too sure about the Aquarius. But we shall see. Um, and then I know. In the other reading. It was Scorpio and Pisces. So. I'm going to just stick with the Zodiac sign. Maybe that. Someone is dying spiritually, yeah, because they're doing all this spell work. And they that's why spirit said final destination. The next hex they do on you is their lies. They can't if it's not, oh, we giving you one more try to do this. No, you got one more try, right? As soon as you try to do that, you getting taken out, or you about to be hurt in a way where you can't do this again to this person. Or this person can't do this again to that person. Something like that. Oh Lord. Here, show us more on his uh, energy. See, Nine of Cups is Pisces energy. So someone, show us more on his energy. Someone could be dealing with a Pisces. Someone is restless because they were greedy and overworking and doing something over and over again. Someone is restless because they realize that someone don't love them, don't, or there's not love. Love don't live here anymore. <laughs> yeah, uh, the moon secrets. Someone definitely was. Ooh, we we got the ace of swords in reverse. Ooh, we. Mm, mm, mm. Someone is not having victory here. Someone is not receiving what they want out of this situation. It could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. This could be pertaining to some type of financial investment or money. Someone is wanting new love with you. It could be a Gemini or a Scorpio or a Leo. Someone really just want to come in and tell you the truth. Because they gain a lot of clarity about all the lies. That someone realized that they're not into someone and they're like, what the heck? Someone waking up or woke up. They're like, what the heck? I don't, what? This was an illusion. Yeah, this was an illusion. Now someone want to rush in and express their love to you. They want to heal things with you. But they're karmic. Yeah, Aquarius. So Aquarius is coming out strongly. So I, I'll probably do Aquarius. I'm going to do Virgo and Aquarius because that's the main message, main signs. And possibly, uh, yeah, someone view someone like everything. Like, man, what? Yeah, someone was trying to deceive someone out of some money. 
they had somebody else working with them. It's so it's like someone waking up and realize like I was coming against the wrong person. That's what this is looking like. Like we done, I done did all that spell work and magic on the wrong person. We got death in reverse, Scorpio energy. This is how it came up in the other reading too. Death in reverse. Why is this death in reverse? Someone is wanting to come out of the cold with the five of pentacles in reverse. Someone was definitely like mischievous, deceptive, trying to get away with, trying to take some money, possibly from a Scorpio. Uh, show us more on death. Why is death here? A mother, something about a mother could have been trying to do this, or you're the mother, baby mother, take it however it resonate. But someone is very fortunate. Wow. We got the death clarifying with the will of fortune. So someone is definitely very, um, is destined to have this for, this great fortune. So whoever was trying to steal, kill, destroy, like they said, final destination. The next hex they do on you will be their last. Or whatever they try to do to you is going to be their last. Wow. Three of Wands, Two of Pentacles. So someone is trying to make a plan. To They're trying to figure out how to balance this out, how to communicate with you, how to work things out. But it's like by any means, they, they, they're going to, I don't know. This person is spying a lot. They're trying to figure figure you out so they can know how to come, come towards you. To, to, to give something to you or to, for you to, uh, uh, no, they want to negotiate or they want to, yeah, this is about the money. All about the money. Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles. Whew. Competition. Yeah, didn't it say that? Like the karmic was in competition with you? Like how? How are you going to be in competition? With a divine. Like, what? You can't. But they, they're going to learn, you know. you just trial and error. <laughs> Whatever this is, they have to learn. They're going to learn. They're going to learn today. They're going to learn. Um. Yeah, this reading was definitely different. But, again, they started, they left. I mean, what? <laughs> They're sorry that they're last. That's not what I was trying to say, but they're sorry that they're last. What is that? What does that supposed to mean? We got, I'm sorry that I left. So, yeah, and they miss their family. So, yeah, everything is just a big old bunch of BS. Like, none of this, this person don't understand. Like, they, I'm confused. Like, they confusing me. No, but... <laughs> This person, that's why they drink it. They drink it a lot, but no, they need to, um, they need to have discipline. We got wealthy men. So, it was all, it was, could have been a lot about the money here. Pathway in reverse, message. Someone, someone realized they went the wrong way, chose the wrong person to work with, ch chose the wrong route. Because things look like it's falling apart. Mature woman and house. Something about a house. We got main male. False person. Marriage. Someone will marry someone for for just to take, steal. Possibly their destiny. Steal their fortune. Their birthright. Like they tried to steal. This is all spiritually. This is spiritual work. Because again, the beginning of the reading, someone's doing black magic on you. So, someone... Could have possibly got into a marriage. This could have been all business. This was not, oh, I love you. I mean, they may have loved you because they knew what they was about to get out of you. <laughs> but um, this was all, like, orchestrated to gain some type of financial wealth. Mm hmm Yep, the thief, for sure. That's just what it was. 35 could be significant. 6, 8, 3, 1. 27, 13, and 24, 33 could be significant. Um, we got July, July 13th, July 24th, July 20th, July 1st, July 6th, July 8th, July 3rd. We have March, um, March could be significant, August, June, or January, 
So whether these are birthdays or special days or significant date due to some of this craziness that's going on, take it however. Some of you, this is like dates that will be coming up. Um, and some is past. How do we want to end this, spirit? Show us a message, please. I want to see, like, what this someone is doing black magic on you. Yeah, the karmic is trying to compete with you. Someone is doing black magic on you. The karmic, I'm telling y'all, the karmic is your ex. This is not, I'm getting, the karmic is your ex and they're dealing with the karmic ex. I mean, wait. Yeah, it could be that. Uh, the karmic is your ex and they're dealing with a karmic ex uh, for some of you your the karmic is your ex and they're dealing with they end up dealing with someone like a co-worker as shown and they end up finding out that that was a karmic yeah they got some stuff over their head because they know what they did because they was working together they thought they would they had a team this person had a plan this, they both was plotting <laughs> this person was the karmic was pro plotting on you how to obtain your wealth. How they want you back if... Yeah, like what? I'm sorry I left. Yeah. Things are falling apart. Only because things are falling apart. They're not taking accountability. They they are only feeling this way and missing you is because things are falling apart. Because they shouldn't have been doing spell work. They shouldn't have been doing black magic. They shouldn't have been messing with you. They shouldn't have been messing with you. I want to see the uh, someone is doing black magic. Let's see more on this. Who is this doing black magic? Show us who is this doing this black magic? Who is this doing this black magic spirit? Whoa. Whoever it is. It could be, yeah, someone who's losing a lot of money. We got the King of Pentacles in reverse. For some of you, it could be a Virgo. Oh, Virgo did come out in an actual name. The Then Virgo. Yeah, Virgo came out in this message. Very clear. Yep, yeah, Virgo. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We got Sagittarius here as well. We got Toxic, Toxic, Toxic. Uh, uh, uh. They hate you because they can't be you. Someone hates you. But yeah, so for some of you, someone, when I ask someone is doing black magic, who is doing the black magic? The King of Pentacles came out in reverse. So it could definitely be a Virgo or any earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or someone who who had uh, had the money and now they're losing the money. That's who's doing black magic on you or who was. And they're stressed out, not a source, because they shouldn't have touched you. You're an earth angel. Is that what it is? Ten of swords. They feel, they feel betrayed because you are okay. Everything is fine with you. They were trying to send all these swords to you. And now they're looking at you because, again, they tapped your phone or tapped your... Or they looking in on your social media, whatever. And they seeing that you're fine. Yeah, because you're, uh, you're highly favored. Blessed. Okay? Because you're not out here doing black magic on people. You're not out here hurting people purposely because to or to get a gain or whatever the heck. Yeah, that's why. So that's why they gotta make they gotta have this dirty fall. You healed. I'm definitely about to do Virgo and Aquarius because the same energy just came out. So I'm gonna do Virgo and, and Aquarius. Maybe uh someone could have those placements if it's not your sun sign. Um, but it's heavy spying. Didn't I say someone spying on someone, watching them so hard? Show us more on the page of swords in reverse. Page of swords in reverse. Page of swords in reverse. Six of wands. Seeing someone's victory, success, out of all the betrayal, all the backstabbing, all the swords that they threw at you. Or threw at us. This, These people or this person is seeing that you are nothing to play with. Why? Because you are highly protected. You don't have to do nothing. You don't have to do nothing. Your spirit guys got your back, okay? And this person mad at it. Justice. Yes, justice has been served. That's what they get. They got to learn a lesson because it's not right. Again, it said the next hexer spell that they do on you is going to be their last. And Final Destination came out. <laughs> it's cut off season. Okay, cut off. Literally. 
uh, cut off by the neck. Something ain't right. Somebody, somebody about to get it. Um, six of swords. Someone is able to move on to peace and calmer waters because justice has been served. Um, someone is, yeah, someone's strength is just what got them out of this situation. Someone is way too strong for any type of spell work, black magic to keep them down or sway them into destroying their life. Like, you're too strong. Someone mental is way too strong. Someone physical is too strong. Like, if someone could not, um, they just, it just wasn't going to work. Mm -mm. Something about Gemini. Uh, yeah, someone have a passion new beginning with someone. I just don't like all this spell work. Like, this is crazy. Someone was really heavy in the spell work, in the black magic, dark magic, confirmation. Like, someone was heavy in it. And now they about to learn because you got justice or whoever on a good end of the stick, they got justice. All right. So, show us a message for this collective um, confessions. What else, Barry? Please show us. A message. Please show us a message. What is this spirit? We have breakup, separation, stop the pattern, silent treatment, abandonment. Yep. It's over. It's over. self indulged Yeah, someone is definitely drinking a lot. Um, someone needs to heal. Work on their self. Work on their, do some shadow work. And appreciate, start learning to learn to appreciate yourself, appreciate life. Someone is too focused on trying to take someone else's life and not their life about to be taken. Mm. Heart with the key. Welcome in love, meeting the one, open your heart, getting together, perfect. Yeah, someone needs to make healthier choices in love and in life. Self-love, self-care, being happier. Yes. Stabbed in the back, heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shock and attack. Woo! Someone needs to make healthier choices, okay? You and the karmic ex that you are with. So you need to make healthier choices because you chose the karmic. You may not be the karmic, but you chose a karmic. So therefore, you made a, a lousy choice. You know, we all have once upon a time in our life or several times. But it's a point, of, it's, a, it's a time where you should learn how to make better decisions. So they're saying, hey, time to make better decisions. So you won't have to go through this again. Because someone is very heavy off in spell work. Black magic, where you have to protect yourself. But, of course, you are protected anyway. Your spirit guides got you. But at the same time, sometimes, especially with all this dark magic, you may have to do extra steps to protect yourself. And that's what it looked like someone could have done. Yep. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, we got I like you in reverse. It's like, no, I do not like you. I don't want you. It's nothing about you that... Do anything for me. I don't like you. Yeah, that's because that black magic wore off. It wore off. The spell work, it wore off. So once that spell work wore off, you're going to see things for what it is. And once you see things for, for what it is, you're not going to love that person or like that person no more. Because you're going to be like, wait, what the heck was I doing with you? Yeah, it wore off. Um, man. Um, we got the mirror, mirror each other's. Yeah, I feel like because of the karma, like y'all both needed to heal. That's why you chose this karma. So either at the end of the day, the situation happened and needed to happen. Because it's it's helping you realize some things about self. Realizing how or, you know, how to choose better in the future. Um, you learn some things due to the spell work that was being done as well. Maybe you never even knew about that type of stuff. But then this situation was a lesson for you. Um, shoot. <laughs> and this person, they're learning a lesson because they're dealing with a, a, their karmic and they're dealing with a karmic. <laughs> and they're like, dang. So for some of you, the, the karmic, they're just mirroring each other. Oh, Lord. And then you and the, the divine and the karmic could be mirroring each other due to making lousy choices in love okay that could be what it is but um i feel like you have overcame the situation i feel like you're not in it i feel like this is all playing out around you uh behind you you know you're not included in this situation is that's why they're trying to come back to you they miss you they want you so yeah they're wanting this connection with you um but we have the grim reaper the relationship is over 
No second chances. Grow and transform your life. Like I said, go learn a lesson. Learn a lesson out of this situation and let this go. Karmics, let it go. Because someone is about to be swiped out. Like, it's about to be very detrimental. It's about to be not so good. It's about to be ugly. If someone want to, you know, whip this magic up again. They're going to wish they didn't. They're going to turn them. Like they're going to they gonna turn themselves into a frog. <laughs> oh, man. Did I do this thing? I don't remember doing this thing. But I feel like if I did, great. If I didn't, I'm not doing it because I'm just not drawn to it. All right, you guys. That's how I'm going to leave it. So... Mm. Yeah. It's time for these karmas to learn these lessons. That's what this is. See y'all later.